W-U-G, it's the BFG. And today we got Waste Nut. Now, I've taken out the Unstable Amulets. Unfortunately, in this modern metagame, Unstable Amulet is just too slow. Yes, it had cool ideas, cool possibilities with Underworld Breach, with Cruxa. But all in all, playing that for two mana has felt incredibly weak. So we change it up a bit. For those of you who don't know about Waste Knot, so our combo is with this card, which gets different abilities based on what the opponent discards. And also Orcish Bowmaster. Now you're wondering, how do these two get together? It is with our ace card, Burning Inquiry. Each player draws three cards, then discards three cards at random. So the draw three triggers Orcish Bowmaster. The discard three triggers Waste Knot. So we get both ends. And the way we do it is essentially set up one or both of these or whatever. We have a little bit of interaction with Thoughtseize, Fatal Push, Galvanic Discharge. And then we either combo off or we drag the game out and try to finish them with Underworld Breach. Now, Underworld Breach can go for as much mana as I have because it is exile three to escape and burning inquiry puts three in the graveyard so i can cast that as many times as i would like our newest addition though is omnixus the adversary now this card i believe has everything we want it makes you discard or you lose life it can possibly help us gain life and when i was testing it out I did a little combo, opponent survived, I had a large uh, orc army that was 7 power. I casualtied it, you see where I'm going? I got a 7 loyalty Obnixilis and made my opponent draw 7, lose 7 so I could shoot them with my bowmaster for game. Will it happen? Probably not, but it was cool as hell to do it. So. Without further ado, let's get into it. When you play, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, man. They still one of my favorite ideas. Yeah. What's BFG secret perk? So, I'll let you guys know right now because I'm gonna. I want you guys to bully upscale until it happens. I want a character in the in the game. If I get a character in the game, then we we be talking. All right. No. What? Um, dude, I'm leaving. Yeah, sometimes I feel like these challenges are out to get me. I'm le Let's play scale right now, actually, you know? Because, oh my, oh my god. Leyline of Sanctity versus me? Oh my, dude, this might not be my, the, yes, the BF Dragon. I'm down, I'm down. Yeah, the, so clock, so clock hour. So the secret perk is they, they gave me a link for their Indiegogo that if you buy the hard copy, you get 10% off uh, be, from me. It's glit. Oh, that makes sense. It's glitz tomorrow. That makes sense. So what you're saying is, oh my God. Okay. 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 That's fine. I need to bobble myself anyway. I need to bobble myself anyway. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, God. Okay. I guess yes, because if I die, I die. And then just bobble myself. Oh, no, dude. I don't want to draw another Bowmaster. I don't want to. I don't want to, man. <laughs> Love, dude. I, if he knows who I am... He probably lost his shit when he had Leyline of Sanctity because he knows I love Thoughtseize. Every deck, dude. I was like, just let me see your hand, man. Just let me see. That's all I want. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Come on. Okay, we drew it. All right. All right. Well, you know what we're going to have to do, right? It's going gonna, it's gonna to suck. It's going to really suck. We're going to be hitting ourselves in the face for a bit. Well, they're not... Yeah, well... They're not dead, okay? They could be dead in like one turn if we draw a land. A 
Also, I like how Canister got on before BFG. <laughs> well, I mean, Canister's playing, right? I saw him sign up for the for the challenge. So, I like I literally started only five minutes before the challenge started. So, but guys, please, if you can, for me, it's free. Just add scale rise of, rise of dragons to your wish list on Steam. Okay, you don't have to buy the hard copy. If you do though, and use my thing. That would also be appreciated. You know, let them know that you guys you guys got my back. And that some of you, when I see you, we can play together. Okay? I want to play a paper game and stream it for Scale Rise of Dragons. And I gave it to... Claw Carver, dude. Thank you, thank you, man, so much. Maybe they just brick really hard. Yeah, sand out. Thank you. You know what? This right here, that optimism, is why you're the number one trophy player right now. Let me raise it back up. Just like like the the belief in yourself and in others is intoxicating. Oh well they're cascading. Terrific. Please please don't get anything. Maybe they whiff? Maybe? Who knows? Oh Atraxa Okay. Wait, no more leyline of the void. Or no no more leyline of sanctity. Oh my god, we can do it. Can we draw a land? If we draw a land, I can kill a Traxa. If I draw a land, we can kill a Traxa. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Let me do it. Let me do it. I want to do it. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, land please. Deck. If there was any time to give me a land, bro, now's the time. Shoot. Shoot, 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 shoot. Okay. I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass. Okay. We're not we're not out of it out of it yet, but Atraxa gave him like so many things. So he took Ardent Plea? Rainforest and Emrakul the Aeon's Torn. So he took three things. So he he can cascade right now. If he hits and if he hits Omniscience, if he hits the Omniscience over here, he can play Emrakul from his hand and win the game. So that's not good. But I don't think Thought Seizing wins us the game, unfortunately. I really don't. I think our best chance here is have him try and play another Cascade if he wants. Get rid of this. We'll bowmaster the plant token so he has one less, right? We'll bowmaster the plant token here. So we're gonna he's gonna ardent plea. We just gotta hope he doesn't hit omniscience, right? So we'll hit the plant. So it's one less. This is crazy, dude. This is crazy. I sideboarded for for freaking frog tide and boros energy and we hit none of that. <laughs> We got we got we got Necro into uh Glimpse. Oh now he has Leyline. Terrific. Yay. Yay. Okay. Well that actually wasn't good for them at least. Right? That wasn't good for them. But what does he get though? Uh gemstone, glimpse, shardless. He chose shardless and colony garden. Okay. Okay. So, we can kill Atraxa here. We might be able to kill them. Can we? Wait, hold on. It's time to do... Math. I'm not sure. I'm afraid we need to use... Math. Okay. Land? Oh, dude, that's... that. Oh, that's kind of hot. Oh, that's kind of hot. Can we do it, though? Okay. Okay. Because if we get both, if we get both, how much is that? But we would have, like, I mean, we got to get lucky. So we're, we're, we're here. We're here to get lucky here. We are here. Can we keep this? Can I keep this? Can I keep this? I kept it. Oh, my God. Wait. Okay, there's no math involved anymore. There's no math involved anymore. We, we have reached the point where we say we ball. And actually it is lethal because this is already... This is, this is plus 6. This is plus 12. We are going to kill him through Atraxa. 
Okay, another one. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay. Hit myself, hit myself, hit myself. Boom. Bang. Let's go! Who needs to target the opponent? Okay. He got Leyline of Anticipation, Leyline of Sanctity, Leyline of the Void. That's what he got. Okay. I'm going to keep this. He, he didn't, he didn't have, holy. It was Omniscience? I, I, can you please go back and look, please. I don't think it was Omniscience. It looked like Leyline of Anticipation to me. When I saw it, that's why I didn't think I was dead. Okay. That's what I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I I swear it was Layla Anticipation. That's why I wasn't worried. If you notice when he when he when he played it, I I was like, oh that's fine. Yeah, it was yeah. It was Layla of Anticipation. Otherwise I would have jumped out of my chair and you know that, okay? Especially you alias. I overreact about everything. Lele of the Void, kind of, kind of good here. Kind of. Okay. I mean, I'm gonna lock myself out of black, but maybe we lock him out of the game. Opponent has the M19 omniscience art. Okay. I was about to say, I'm like, I, I'm pretty. Sh oh no, I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want to play that. I don't want to play that. I want to play this. I want this one. I'm going to hit the plant token. Screw you, plant token! Okay. Now we gotta hope that he doesn't have Cascade this turn. I think I'd be okay with locking myself out of black if he doesn't have Cascade this turn. Right? I think we're cool with Magus here. Wait, are you serious? Uh, say psych right now. 100%? Oh my god. What? Okay, he's locked out. Let's go. Now we smush. Now we smush face. So. Holy crap. Oh my god, he had Emrakul, because didn't we, didn't we discard, didn't we discard, um, Emrakul with, uh, what's it called? With Burning Inquiry? Oh no, Alias was, uh, uh, that hurts, that's gross, that's gross. Dude, uh. Yeah, no, okay. Fair enough. I don't, like, dude, I was honest. I I thought it was, like, when I saw, so I saw Leyline, Leyline, and then I saw, I thought it was Blue Leyline. Uh, maybe that's what he thought, too? Maybe? I'm not sure. Because it, I don't know. Burning Inquiry? Bloodstained Mar Bloodstained Mountain. Okay. Dude, that's wild. So he could have just played Omniscience and killed us. Or he could have just played Emrakul and killed us. Because he had Emrakul. He definitely did. Okay. So. We're actually not going to be fast enough to kill him unless we draw Burning Inquiry here. We're not going to be fast enough. Burning Inquiry would get it. But we need we would need that. How much time left? One more turn, right? Yep, next turn. That's not good for us. This doesn't bode well for us. At all. He was able to suspend. He was able to suspend his glimpse and we still can't kill him. He's We locked him out of everything but suspending glimpse. Okay. Oof. 
Well, we could be dead. Maybe they whiff. Thank you, Shime. Thank you. I appreciate you. Real cool. Hey, what do they get? Please whiff. Maybe. Possibly. Come on. Come on, you don't want to kill me. Well. Okay. Okay. That, that, uh, that's a big boy. That is quite large. Okay. What's our out? Burning inquiry? Burning inquiry into what? <laughs> uh okay because okay we burn an inquiry here if we draw it we have to draw inquiry and into a swamp the molten collapse and then we can kill him because i can't use the pings to get a track so right it would have to be something else so another glimpse suspended okay so it would have to be inquiry into swamp molten collapse attract so or draw swamp collapse no like emrakul is going to emrakul is going to kill us here fortunately so okay. so the ideal draw is is uh that is still still the same let's see let's just see our top deck i'll, I'll play this out come on bro you have emrakul what are you doing no we didn't Okay. That's those are some big boys right there. Those are some big big boys right there. Okay, so you open Leilana Sanctity twice. Oh boy. Okay. I don't I don't think we can change it. I need the discard because if he doesn't open up Sanctity we can get him. I mean I think we just have to take the risk. He's opened up Sanctity twice. No way three times, right? Come on. Come on now. Have to, yeah. Okay. Yes. We got Giganta. Dude, I'm going to keep this and hope he doesn't have Leyline. That's what I'm doing. This is the prayer. He's opened up double Leyline game two, Leyline game one. I got to hope he doesn't have it. We gotta, we gotta pray here. Five. Oh my God, he doesn't have it. Thoughtsy's time. Let me see your hand. Let me see. No, no, no. I wanna see. Come on. Show me. Show me. So, three lands and shardless? Yeah, I'm going to take that. I'm going to take that one. Okay. And then I'm going to... So, we got to we gotta stifle our thought teases here. So, on his turn... On this turn, I'm going to play Bowmaster. Well, on his turn, I'll play Bowmaster. And then the next turn is when I thought he's again. So that way, you know, we get to see two more of his cards. Because then it'll be right before turn three. We cannot thought see the top of the deck, okay? We can't. It's impossible. But wouldn't it be great? Also, Shimeco was right. If we inquired the inquiry, that would have been six damage. We would have won. The okay. raw. What do you got, buddy? 
play Colony Garden, right? Yeah. Oh, you said, oh, sorry, sorry, Alias, sorry, sorry. Okay. You still only use an 18, yeah, only eight, upscale. This is a different deck, this is a different deck. This is different than the other one. The other one is heavy, is heavy, more heavy discard. This one has a combo in it. This is more combo based. It still can be mid rangey and grind, but it has like a combo where I can bury my opponent, essentially. Like, bow, if I have Waste Knot, if I, if I have two Waste Knots, Bowmaster and Waste Knot, or double Bowmaster, Burning Inquiry should just win the game on the spot. Like, like it did game one, right? Even though he could have Omniscience, right? He could have. But, yeah. Okay. That's a lot of lands. That's a, that's a lot of lands. That, that kind of hurts, actually. Like a great deal. We only have 18 lands in the deck. Yeah. Right side, there's only 13 more lands. So. Sorry, 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 sorry. sorry. Uh, I apologize. I'm, 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 I'm so, I'm so sorry. Okay. I hope, I hope my stickers keep you warm at night. Okay. Help you out. I still love you. Okay. <laughs> God, what is he doing? Surveil. I, he's gonna play Garden this turn, right? He has to. Zyren, thank you, thank you for the follow, man. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Brian Pan, how you doing, man? How you doing? Yeah, we're playing versus the Glimpse. You're a madman. What? How is it wild? I only need two to work my deck. I'm, um, eh? Moppy Herb, thank, hey. Oh, Demoran, thank you for the follow, man. Moppy Herb, how you doing? How you doing, man? Yeah, like, so, so the thing is, uh, I'll scale, so the way it works is like, we only, I only have two three drops, which is two Obnix lists. The previous build had no three drops. Everything stops at two. If I can get just three mana, my whole deck is unlocked. And actually three mana, like I can combo off on one turn. Because I have a two drop plus a one drop that combos with it. So. Oh, please. Fell into the trap. Mop your, hey, it's all good, man. It's all good. Yeah, I like, I like One Piece, okay? I don't like, I haven't played the game. Okay, I haven't played the card game. I know. But I'm too much into magic, you know? Like I enjoy magic a lot. And then. The new game that I'm starting on top of that is Scale Rise of Dragons, right? Which is, I mean, I kept the treasures out. I, did, I just think they're awesome. Nice little shiny treasures. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Anyway. So. For me, for me, I think it's fun, but you need a bigger brain than me to be good at it. I gotta, I gotta work on it. I gotta work on it to play it. So I was like, hey, Bobby, hey, no worries, man. Hey, bro, bro. Oh, my God. I would like to do this and keep Thoughtsies, please. Oh, my God, we did. Oh, my God, we're, 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 we're gaming. We're gaming. Oh, oh, it's, it's happening. It's happening. Okay, one, three. Get rid of this. I know nothing. So let us Thoughtsies you. Now that's a hand. Now that's a freaking hand, dude. Let's attack for five. Play this, we'll surveil on his end phase. So, knocking on wood, he does not draw a Cascader here, okay? Please don't. That's all you can draw to kill me. Okay. I think we're clear. Let's get the Rakus. No more lands, please. Please, no more lands. Duress? I mean, we know two of his three cards. What are the odds? 
that the third one happens to be a spell. Let's dismiss these. Let's see. Oh my god, it was. We get to draw a card. Holy moly. Okay. I, I did that I feel like an absolute win now. That's an absolute win. Okay. Down to six. Yeah. <laughs> he can kill us at one life. He can kill us at one life. We need a way to do one more damage. We need a bowmaster inquiry. We need something to kill him next turn. Please. Please, please. Because, yeah, I mean, we're, I mean, any moment he could just drop an Atraxa and Emrakul on me. <laughs> this is the game where I felt like I've had the most control, yet I could still die. Because that's just how their deck works. They just, they like to gamble. Clearly this guy visits the casino very often. You can play 13 more lands. <laughs> also, um, uh, Upscale Games, can you purchase this from your store? Are you able to? Oh, let's go! We won! Okay, okay. Because I am not artistic at all. Uh, no, no, she doesn't have to see that. No, she doesn't have to see that. She doesn't have to know. What are you talking about? She doesn't know about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we're fine. We're fine. Wait. I can have perfect information. Aha. Boom. Ulamog. Okay. Boom. So, so he has Ulamog on top. Okay. Yeah. He's going to get himself some stuff here. Well, yeah, nothing can go wrong. Okay, let's see. We put the roof on, and nothing can go wrong. At last, the roof goes on, and nothing can go wrong. Oh, no, it all went wrong. Take through the breach, I guess. <laughs> oh. Anyone watch Chowder growing up? We put the roof on and nothing can go wrong. Oh no, it all went wrong. We don't cover for that. <laughs> Through the magical world of batteries. We just got Baseju. Uh. <laughs> His hand's bad. We can wait a turn, I guess. But I'm, I'm contemplating burning in Cory the world. That's what I'm contemplating right now. Okay, another ancient stirrings. Yep, 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 yep. Then the world. Oh my God. Oh, he got he got Kozilex. Okay. Play Labyrinth, put Ulamog underneath, maybe? Perhaps? Ulamog goes under? Okay. I'm, I'm scared. I'm real scared right now. Real spooky. Um. Ew. Okay, we're gonna pass. I'm gonna try and play it slow here. Since we have Underworld Breach and Inquiry, like, we would have a possibility to do something, but let's see. Let's see what happens. I'm not liking our draws, but let's see how it goes. That do nom nom when seeing biomass and don't stop before there's a. Okay, so, boom. You definitely don't want those around you. That's actually pretty cool, though. 
I like that, like, I like the idea of Warhammer 40k. The only thing is, I am so poor, okay? I don't think you understand. Like, I would, like, I, I know, I've seen people play and know how much they pay to play that game, dude. That's, um, split out of my range. Okay. I mean, I have to borrow decks from people, okay? To play Magic. I'm poor, too. What the, do you play Warhammer? Honestly, if you don't want to be poor, just sell all the Warhammer. Okay? Boom. Instant, infinite money glitch. I'm just saying. Okay? Get rid of a waste knot. Boom. Through the breach, devour. Boogan's Labyrinth. So we know those three, actually. All right, take it up. Just take it up. That's fine. All right. He doesn't want to discard anything. I don't like that. I do not like that at all. He doesn't want to discard anything. You play O'Hara and Smells' first lesson. Give me three. Th yeah, Elias, first lesson. <laughs> yeah, give, first thing, give me $3,000. Damn. That's just, holy crap. <laughs> first thing, give me all your money. All right, are you having fun? <laughs> right. Army wants to amp raptor. Yeah, I might do it. I'ma do it. I'm I'm crazy. I'm game. Cast. Oh my gosh. Pick up. Sure. Whatever. At least if he kills my raptor, I'll be able to push it real good. Plastic crack. I mean, I mean. Hey, what's he doing? Oh no. Oh no, what is this? So we don't know any cards now that he has. We don't know anything. We know nothing. Two, four, six, seven, eight, nine. He left a card on top. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Uh, we'll let it go. We'll let it go. If he has another Ulamog the Defiler, if that's what it is, so be it. But we're not stopping Devour. We're not stopping World Breaker. We're not stopping Soy Micro Spawn. We're not so stopping another Kozilex Command. The only thing we stop here is a Devour. Um, Old mug. Why did I say anything? Why would I say anything? What the heck's wrong with me? Well, there's only one thing that would really suck. How do you get ten counters? Oh, because Ulamog's under. I need a red source. I was I was counting the mana and I was like the only thing he could cast with this is Ulamog. Red source, please. Oh my goodness. Okay. Underworld breach. Okay. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Pick up. Pick it up. Picking it up there. Okay. Now, we bobble. One, two, three. Done. I'm going to 
W. Uh, Devour is freaking awesome for you. That's I'm I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. We're really screwed here. <laughs> I just realized that right at this moment. We're really, 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 really screwed. Okay, I can do it again. One, two, three. Because I want, like, we're going to... Back to uh, Yeah. And then we Molten Collapse. Two. Three. Okay. One. Okay. Well, he's drawing Devourer here. That's not good for us. Okay. He's going to devour my Obnixilus here. Are the first buying plans for my room and an air dispenser? Oh, nice. Okay. By the way, guys, I might start streaming more live magic at a card shop. For those of you who are in the Discord, um, I am in talks with a card shop right now. And it's, uh, not gonna lie, getting kind of serious. So that would make it a three. I mean, if he has nothing, if he has nothing, we could block with the Dragon Rage and kill it, right? Okay. We have nothing. I don't like it. Sure. Don't do it. Don't have calls like. Don't have calls like. Don't have calls like. Please, 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 please. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. All right. It's most dystopian, jeez. Ah, uh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. You think you're so cool, huh, opponent? Just because you got codeless command and I don't. Whatever. Whatever. One ring? Throwing Michael Spawn kicked. Do a backflip, kick me in the balls here. Okay. Did you pay your auction bill this month? You, there was there was such a cool thing. Uh, so <laughs> there was a there was a whole thing about this where it was like, what if oxygen is slowly like burning us to death, and it just takes seventy years for it to happen? Because oxygen like rust like steel, oxygen like it is it likes to interact with other atoms, right? Or other like molecules. Like, what if it just takes that long to kill us? It, uh, that's why. That's why. Act. That, it, it also, that's why antioxidants are so good for you, right? So, I mean, just saying. Just saying. Okay, well, he's he's swinging at me. I'm terrified. All right. Um, I guess next turn we try to get Giganta if we don't draw anything. Oh, he just got something back. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Oh. Would you like to mill half my deck? Would you like to mill half my deck, sir? I got seven cards left. I got seven left. Holy wacamole, dude. One inquiry, two inquiry, three inquiry, four, five inquiry, six inquiry, seven inquiry, be dead. So the guy Ulamog me twice. It wasn't the first one, but the second one definitely got me. I'm keeping this. Oh, I'm keeping this. Oh, bro, I'm keeping this. Okay. We get perfect knowledge again, but this time we have Bowmaster and Wasteland. He mill with the kick. Oh, it's not kicked. It's not milling. He X. So Ulamog is 10 mana. Okay, Ulamog's 10 mana. And what it says is when you cast it, exile the opponent's deck, half their deck rounded up. And then you get you get to um, do other stuff afterwards. It gets it gets like plus one plus one counter for the highest mana that's exiled, and it counts his exile too. So if he has like an Emrakul exile, it gets plus fifteen plus fifteen. It's it's just oh fuck. Okay, this dude just kept a hand with lands and a devour and a dream. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough, sir. Okay. Yeah, he, yeah, he got he got double Ulamog on me. Okay. Well, we're just gonna play the foundry here, and we're gonna play a waste nut. I would like to play the waste nut, please. All right, now, if I Amp Raptor, my moons are dead hits, right? If I Amp Raptor, my moons are dead hits here. What are you doing? What are you doing? Not Knots here! The hell is this? So if we, my only dead draw here is moons, right? Took one of the Raptors. Okay, makes sense, makes sense. Probably playing Raptor here. Because if we hit like Galvanic Discharge, Molten Collapse. Galvanic Discharge. There we go. How about how about that one? How about that one? We're going pretty low on life here. But I definitely need pressure. I think Dragon Rage is definitely the option. We've only been hitting ourselves, but I think we definitely need the Dragon Rage there on board. What does he have here? Okay, we just drew Molten Collapse, which is awesome. Okay, swing, swing. Okay. What is he doing? You're gonna play. Okay, sure. I still get in. I still get in, baby. Dragon Rage, man. Three power. Let's go. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, six. He's one away. So he's played Cavern, both Groves. He doesn't play this card, Plution, though. Does not play this card, Plution. Well, so we know his hand. It's Devour Carplution. Okay. We have Molten Collapse, which is going to be really cool for us. Get the Theater. No more lands, please. Play Bowmaster. Okay. Hit him with it. Play Waste Knot. On top. Sure, 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 sure. We take the raptor. We take the raptor here. 
Attack with all creatures. We know he has Devour, Carplution. He's going to play Devour this turn. It just depends what he kills, right? Because then we're going to Molten Collapse it. And then we'll, we'll like, he's going to kill my board, right? So. You may exile close to me if you do with five damage to each creature. Yeah. Mia yeah, Todd, thank you, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Okay, it was. Yep, you get to do that. And then also take one of my waste nuts. That's really good. Really good for you. So, did he play the Carplution yet? Did he play another different land or something? Because. All right. Oh, sure. Yep, yep, yep. Devourer. Okay, let's play. Let's cast our Molten Collapse here. Just in case we happen to hit, um, like, Burning Inquiry, I want to be able to cast it off the Raptor. So let's do it. Do it, do it. Waste Knot? Sure. We take it. We'll take the Waste Knot. All right. So he has Carplusion left, right? What else you got, opponent? Basaju. He drew Basaju. Okay. All right. Give give me give me the giant elk. I'll take one elk, please. I will take your finest elk. What did you draw? I mean, there's a lot of good draws in that deck, dude. There's a lot of good draws in that deck. That's not one of them. Okay. Dude, holy crap. We have... I, I, I'm, I'm telling you guys, I swear to you, we only have 18 lands. Okay? I'm telling you right now. There are only 18 in here. Seven. Lethal next turn. One more whiff. And we got ourselves a chance. One more whiff. What did he get? Is he counting his mana? I don't like that. If he's counting his mana, I'm not happy. If he's making sure he has 10. He has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10? Uh, that's not. Maybe he's bad at counting. Bruh. Bruh. Oh my god. Okay. Well, we have to see if he has an answer, right? We have to just attack. And then afterwards, we'll do the shenanigans, right? We do the shenanigans after. Let him Kozilek's command, right? Let him do his thing. He's going to tap for like 50 million right now. Not the math. So, uh, Demo D Demon Rat, all we got to do is just wait. So, he's going to do Kozilek's command, right? And he's going to kill Gigantha and also probably s surveil that many and draw a card, right? Wait. Not doing that? You're not killing Gigantha? You're just going to block it? Okay. I got a pretty crazy turn then. Hold on. Hold the phone now. Hold the phone. No. If. Oh man. Oh, oh man. I have. Okay. I have duress. Right? I have Amp Raptor. I think we... Uh, this is so rough. This is so rough. He put three cards on top, five cards on the bottom. Okay. Fine. One. Okay. I'm not going to play the Blood Crypt here. Right? Um. Okay. Now... I think we duress. 
to try and draw into something here. One, two, three, and if not, then we we just Camp Raptor. Oh, okay. So he does have Eulamog, but we get to draw two here. Oh, there we go. There we go, baby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's all coming together. Actually. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I, I need to play the land just to be safe. Yes. Amp Raptor. Da -da. Da. Amp Raptor. Dragon Rage, Duress, Marsh Flats. And keep the Duress. There we go. What do we hit? What are we flipping? What are we flipping? Oh wait, it is, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. We're not flipping because it's from the graveyard. Never mind, I'm done. I'm done. Don't listen to me. I thought these. Give me the Ulamog. Give it to me. Give it to me, that was such a good draw. Give me that. Make two creatures. Uh, uh, oh, I passed without bobbling. Oh God. Oh God, the punts. They're, they're starting to come in now. They're starting to come in. It might be because it's 2 a.m. 2 here. That might be it. But... Bruh. Bruh. Top deck one ring? Really? I really know. Hmm. Hmm. What are you casting? Are you kidding? There is no way. Oh, wait. That's right. He stacked his deck. I was like, there's no way, but he stacked his deck. What am I talking about? He legit stacked the deck. And so did we, apparently. <laughs> apparently, we stacked our deck. I, I mean, I, 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 don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know what to say, man. I was like, oh, yeah, he stacked his deck. We stacked our deck. It's all good, man. It's all good, man. One. Two. Yes. Kill it. Discharge. Hey, Red. Boom, get it. All right. All right, I guess we stacked our deck, so it's fair. Fair is fair. He stacked his, we stacked ours. We're good. The land shutter, how you, how you doing, man? Yeah, did, yeah, he... Wait, yeah, okay, he got the one ring. So that means he had two one rings and Ulamog, right? So that means he did, he did stack that. He did stack that. Because he put three on top. When I looked at the thing, he put three on top. And five to the bottom when he scratched for eight. So it was one ring, one ring, Ulamog. That he that he did. Okay, kicked. That's fine. That's fine. That's cool. That's cool with me. I got a lot of attackers, bro. I got a lot of attackers. What else you got? What else you got? Five, six, seven. What is this? Another one? Okay. Okay, okay. That's not good for me. We're down to two mana now. But I believe if my math is math and you're dead, I swing with everything. And that's four damage. If I'm not mistaken, if the, my math my maths are correct. Alpha. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Take take four. Down to two. One ring. With it, when what do you think when they unban? You mean when they ban Nadu? Say that. How you doing, man? You mean when they ban Nadu? Good riddance. 
And, okay, this is my problem. It pissed me off what they said afterwards, okay? If they would have just banned it and been okay, we're good, it's banned, get out of here, right? Okay, fine. But when they said they didn't test the card, then there's no reason to not ban it, right? In the beginning, you know, when everyone was calling for the ban right away, if you didn't test the card and it makes an unhealthy format, you have more reason to ban it early. Like, there, you made it so it's like, oh, we don't want to, you know, ban things out of nowhere. And it's like, you legit made a worse experience for people for like two months instead of banning your mistake. Just ban the mistake. Jeez. I don't know what's so hard about that. Because, yeah, true. Because money. I, I can answer that question. For money. Um, I'm gonna take this. Take this. Cause I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pop off here, folks. We gonna pop off. Unless we draw land. Ooh, we be cooking after that. We took, we took K. We took Kozil X command here. I can't say K command. There's already Coligan's command. We can't say that. Oh. 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 Okay, we got Blood Moon. Blood Moon would be kind of cool, right? If we do a fetch so we can play a Swamp. The only thing we couldn't cast would be um, Cruxa Reanimate. We only have one in the deck, though. So we just need one fetch line to get one Swamp and everything is open. So, I mean, I wouldn't even be mad, right? Getting rid of Black right now because we have double Amped. So we just play Bowmaster here, draw land, play Blood Moon? I mean, okay, he ancient stirrings here. They so play the card pollution we knew about. These are three cards in his hand right now. He just got, dude, stop stream sniping. Stop it. Seriously, get some help, man. All right. Stop it. Stop, stop it right now. Why wouldn't you play sewing micro spawn, huh? Huh? Why not? Why wouldn't you want to ramp instead of you ancient stirrings? Doesn't make sense. Yeah. The nudist, yeah. Okay, swinging. I love to sing her about the Mona and the Juna and the Springer. I love to sing her. I don't understand why Dodger didn't have X. Honestly, don't make it a 3 4. Give it three toughness. Let a bolt kill it, please. Please. Like, there's many other things you could have fixed on that card, but at least, at least don't make it a 3 4. And flying. Don't forget about the ability. The ability is broken. We already knew that. We knew that. But. Okay. Two. Four. Yeah. Okay. At least I get to do more damage to you. At least I get to do more damage. Give me all the damage. That's what I want. Oh, it gets both? Oh, hell yeah. Okay. What do you put? What do you put? He put two to the bottom. Okay. So they were crap. Okay, good. Good, good, good. We need a land, though. I need to drop this Blood Moon, like, now. Like, right freaking now. Because he's going to play one ring, right? He's going to go Ugin's Live one ring? If he goes Sewing Micro Spawn now, dude's crazy. 
but I mean, I get it. Because if he goes sowing Micro Spawn, he dies. Guys, fun fact. Sowing Micro Spawn will kill him. Let him do it. If he tries to play Lab and Micro Spawn, he will die. Well, we have to draw a land, right? Because he kicks it. He kicks it, right? With Lab. 2, 4, 5, 6. He kicks it with Lab. We get one. I need one more land to kill him. Because we could, we need a discharge and burning inquiry. So I'd burning inquiry first, right? We burning inquiry first. See if we can hit a land. Because this will be a seven, so that's eight damage here. So if he kicks this, I mean, he could die. He's kicking it. Hey, if you're listening right now, opponent. You should definitely, you should definitely not play so in Michael Spawn. Definitely not. Okay. He kicked it. He kicked it. Can we draw a land from the top rope and finish him off? Find out on the next Dragon Ball Z. At last, the beastly power has been harnessed. Waste not. As awoken. Now Cell will battle a warrior 11 years in the making on the next Dragon Ball Z. See what happens. Huh? Well then. Well, well, well. What have we here? Well, see ya. So that... Burning Inquiry. I got a very Burning Inquiry. And one. Two. A three. That'll bring you down. Just a little bit. Out here. And then we will finish you with the Arc Army token. If that's okay. The only thing that saves him is another uh, Kozilek's Command. He's used two already. Does he really have another one? Does he really have another one? That's insane. That's insane if he has another one. Please no. Please no, sir. Okay. Okay, good. Good. Nice. Nice. Was that so hard? That was fun, right? Oh, I got it. I got it. Nice. Now, the sixth and last round was actually versus Canister. Yes, that guy. One of the best Amulet Titan players, if not the best Titan player of all time. And, well, you can go take a look at that game on his channel. It should be going up soon. If it is, I'll leave it in the description below. Go check it out.